Hey everyone, welcome back to our Wednesday video share and welcome if you are new here. My name is Terry, and I host Decorate with Tip and More. I love to decorate on a budget and share with you how I do that in our own home. I love to do DIYs, crafting, and I also love to um, share home shopping um, hauls with you. Also, um, I love decorating for the season. If this is something you like to watch or even like to learn how I decorate on a budget, please consider going up to my page and start following me or just keep on coming back to see if this is something you would like to um, watch on a regular basis. So thank you for coming by and watching today's video. I'm going to do a revamp on an item. This is something that um, we thought about throwing it away, but then decided maybe we can revamp it and use it in our home. Or we found in a thrift store that had good bones and we thought, well, we can change this to um, fit in our home as well. So for mine, I went to um, Salvation Army and I did some shopping. I did find a few things that I will be sharing um, on a future shopping haul with you. But today I am going to be um, sharing how I revamp this arrangement I found in Salvation Army. It was $2, it was a yellow tag, so I got 75% off of that price. So it was under a dollar. The vase itself is cute. It's got a Christmas scenery. It's worth what I paid for for all of it. And I can use the greenery. Some of the picks that I um, see here, I don't like. So instead of just tearing this all apart, I'm gonna remove the things that I don't want in my arrangement and change them to um, things I found at the Dollar Store and Dollar General. So for the white um, picks, I thought about changing them up to this real pretty um, eucalyptus. Um, it's kind of a lime and dark green. I just thought this would be really um, super cute by the evergreen and with the red um, poinsettias that I found. They are a velvet with gold trimming. And also I found um, some gold glitter pine cones with some berries. We're gonna use those three to replace some of these. Then I found this cute little tag at the Dollar Tree. I thought that was super cute to place in my arrangement as well, along with a Dollar General Crush Velvet um, Little Nutcracker. Now, if you're not a Nutcracker person, which I've heard um, some of you are not, um, this is just adorable. I think this would look really pretty in my arrangement. But if you don't like nutcrackers, you can place a cardinal bird, which would be really pretty, or even just a really pretty decorative ornament or a pretty ribbon. Um, just make a little bow and stick it in there. You don't have to do exactly what I'm doing, but I give you tips on what you can do to, to change up a um, Christmas arrangement by just pulling out the stems that you do not like anymore or that don't go with your color theme that you're um, going to be decorating with. I am just pulling out all of the um, items that I do not want in um, my vase. This is what I am left with everything away from the container because I want to paint the silver part. I'm going to leave the gold, but I'm going to paint the silver um, with my cracked pepper and then maybe dry brush the raised um, detailing with some white. I'm going to clean off the vase just real good. Make sure that it's free from any grime or dust or dirt. And I'm going to go ahead and just paint the silver part. Now I'm going to take some white and do a dry brushing effect to the raised portion of that base. All right, now I'm going to take just a little bit of rub and buff 
and with my finger all of the gold just to give it a little more shine now I'm just going to take a little bit and just highlight some areas all right this is what we've got going on right now I use some dry brushing with white and then um, highlighted it with some gold all the um, raised detailing so pretty I like how the vase looks now all right now I'm going to um, spread back out reshape my greenery and this is what my base will look like. I'm going to turn on my hot glue gun. And now what I want to do is add a little bit of this eucalyptus from the Dollar Tree. And I want to find the front of my vase, which will be right there. And I'm going to cut just the stems off and poke it into the foam. I'm gonna add my little um, tag here. The thing I don't want is the um, embellishment and the rope. So I'm gonna remove the tag and that little twine and I'm gonna pull the berry and the bow off. So I'm just using this and I am going to take one of the old um, picks that I removed and I want to add it to my tag so I'm going to take some hot glue applying a lot of hot glue so that to reinforce that the pick stays on that tag. I think I'm gonna staple it on as well. I'm just gonna take that and just use one staple. Now I'm gonna add my, add my tag to the center of the arrangement. Just like that. Now I'm gonna add some poinsettias to um, my arrangement and again this is what it looks like when you buy it taking my heat gun and pressing the flowers back into shape and that's what it looks like after you press them so much better what I've got so far now I want to add some pine cones take the stick and push it into the bottom of the nutcracker. Super cute. Let me see if this would look, what this would look like if I added just a little bit of white. We'll add some of this to it. I like that. I think that added just a little bit of a wispiness that it needed. And plus it brought out the holly jolly wording um, since I added the white. Um, this is super cute. I love how the vase turned out, which is some paint and some rub and buff. It really brought that vase to life. Also, I'm changing out um, the um, old worn out um, flowers um, to some new. I just bought some Dollar um, Tree um, stems. I bought three of them and then this little uh, Holly Jolly um, tag sign. Adorable. I did add a Dollar General. Um, I think they're called Flock Red um, Nutcracker. Um, but if you don't like the Nutcracker, would this not be adorable to add a Cardinal instead? Or maybe get some beautiful ornaments and um, tack them um, with some sticks and place them all around your arrangement. So many things that you can do. I went with the Nutcracker. If you didn't guess it already, I'm going with the Nutcracker theme. I just love how this arrangement turned out. Um, so, 
If you see something that um, doesn't work in your house, that you've had it for a long, long time and it's worn out, take some stems out and replace them with new stems. Um, it's something that you could um, revamp every year to match your um, theme for that Christmas season. I love this. If you like how my revamp turned out, please give me a big thumbs up and sprinkle this onto your page so more of your friends will see what you're watching and maybe want to come over and watch it um, themselves. Y'all, thank you for coming by. I hope um, you enjoy our Christmas season. It's kicking off next week. So thank you for watching. I hope you all have a great Wednesday. I will see you tomorrow. God bless.